Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a day in the life of a full-time content creator. I hope you enjoyed this little morning montage. My boyfriend is asleep, so I just didn't even want to start talking. Plus, in the morning, I just want to get up and get stuff done. I usually clean up and have my space clean and ready to go the night before, but I was so tired last night that our place was just like kind of a mess. So I couldn't even get anything done until my kitchen was clean, organized that bathroom, my closet and all of that. Um, I had some bone broth and just a slight snack just because I'm only doing about like a 30 minute workout right now. After I go, I'm gonna go get a lymphatic massage. I have an appointment today. Then I'll come back and do 30 minutes of just like walking, a little bit of cardio. What else I have today? I have to take pictures, I have to edit. Yeah, I'm just kind of be taking you through the day. I only got about 30 minutes, which I'm gonna get that done now. And then we're gonna go back, get ready, and then get ready to go. <laughs> mentioned just a quick little 30 minute upper body workout I just hit shoulders chest and triceps I just did a couple exercises for each chest shoulders and tries are my shortest day of the week but I have like a full week of workouts updated coming soon I have my appointment in an hour it's only 15 minutes away which is great but I can't eat 30 minutes prior to my massage so I have to have something right now I'm not super hungry so I'm gonna go with just like a protein shake but I'm gonna load it up with some bananas. I'm, I'm going for like a chocolate banana peanut butter mood situation. So that's what we're gonna have. A banana in the freezer last night because I don't like adding ice to my smoothies. I feel like I like it. It just comes out chunky. It doesn't come out as smooth. So frozen fruit is always better. I got some spinach too. Okay. Got some frozen spinach. And then also got a couple new packs of the Cacao Bliss from Earth Echo, who is sponsoring today's video. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about them while I make this smoothie. So if you have not heard of Earth Echo, they are a supplement brand. They produce high quality, organic, non-GMO superfoods, with my favorite superfood from them being the Cacao Bliss. It helps boost energy, it's low carb, it's vegan friendly, plus it tastes absolutely amazing. There are so many ways to use this product. You can obviously drink it, but you can also bake with it. I've seen other customers creating brownies and donuts, which I too will be testing out myself very soon. So stay tuned for that. But what I also love about the Cacao Bliss is that it's a natural energy product. It's loaded with so many amazing ingredients like raw cacao, which is a powerful antioxidant, MCT oil to help support your brain health and turmeric, which supports your joints and boosts your immunity. You get that energy boost, better focus without having to consume a crazy amount of caffeine and experience the jitters that coffee and energy drinks give you. So here's my smoothie. Even though it's green, I promise you, it tastes so good. Super rich, super chocolatey, got the banana, the peanut butter. Of course, I have a discount code for Earth Echo, which I will put on the screen. And also, I will list down in the description box for my exact link. So make sure you guys grab me some of this. And then they also have their little travel packs, little minis. So when you're on the go, you can just kind of take it with you. And obviously, you can drink them on your own. You don't have to add it to anything. So you can just have it with like some water, some almond milk, and have it cold, hot, you know, starting to get cold outside. So you can have like a little hot cocoa moment with these. Thank you again, Earth Echo, for sponsoring today's video. I'm gonna drink this and then we're gonna go get dressed and then we're gonna hop on the road. Mmm. I forgot my hemp seeds. There's a few hemp seeds in here. I love these just for the texture, you know? All right, I just popped on this little outfit from Skims. It's these biker shorts and then I have the Skims bra on. There's a specific bra that comes with these, but I didn't feel like putting that one on. I like one of the new bras and then one of the boyfriend t-shirts. And then I'm just gonna wear some high white socks with my Air Forces. We're just trying to be comfy and casual, you know? Smash that smoothie, it was so good. 
We put a little lotion on them. I mean, I know they're going to be rubbing me down in like oils and stuff, but I just need something. And Houston has been ridiculous. One week it was like in the 40s and now it's back up into like the high 70s, 80s. So it's still warm outside. I'm not going to put like a full face of makeup on. But I do just want to, want to put on sunscreen. Just put on maybe just a little blush. And cover up my dark spots. Keep it real simple. It's going to take me about two minutes. All right, in the car, about to head out to the Tox Houston. I'm actually right on time. I don't like being right on time. I prefer to be early. And I <laughs> just drove over the curb. <laughs> Y'all ain't see that. Especially with Houston and the traffic and the accidents and stuff out here. I don't like to leave right on time. So I think it's rude to be late. And now, okay, look. Already, traffic. I'm going to be two minutes late. And if you don't know what, like, I'm getting a lymphatic massage. I've had them before. I love them. Especially if you're feeling, like, kind of extra bloated or can't go to the bathroom and having, like, issues with your digestion. Lymphatic massages are great. When I was in Tulum... I kid you not, I hadn't gone to the bathroom for like three days. I was so bloated, literally sitting at like an extra 10 pounds heavier. And I went and had a lymphatic massage. As the woman was like massaging me, I could like, you could hear, and I know she could feel my stomach started to like bowl up. Like I had to go to the bathroom immediately. She just got everything flowing and going. Woke up the next day, even that same day I felt amazing. Woke up the next day down 10 pounds. Just because I was just holding on to so much water and I hadn't gone to the bathroom in a few days. It's just so great for, you know, just getting things going.
I am back from my lymphatic massage. And maybe I'm gonna have to go back. You know, she did my legs and stuff first. And then the moment she hit my stomach, you can hear all the rumbling and bumbling. Like I could feel the water. Like she was like, whoa. <laughs> Whoa, there, there's a lot going on in here. I knew I was holding on water. I knew I was bloated, but I, yeah, it was not smooth at all. And then my quads, ooh, my quad hurt a little bit, just like my right one, just because I hit quads and glutes the other day. I have to go back because I feel like there was more that, obviously they can only do so much in an hour, but there's, stuff, there's definitely more in my stomach that needs to come out. But it was amazing. It's super clean, nice in there. There was tons of space in the room we were in. It was just like a nice little vibe. I wanted to fall asleep, but I want to go to sleep right now, but I just got way too much work to do. But it was so good. So if you're in Houston, they're in Houston, they're in LA, and they're in New York. So I had already came across them when they were in LA, but I, by the time I did find them, because I love lymphatic massages, I love them. We were already in Denver at the time. So I love that they're in Houston and it's literally only 15 minutes from me. I was asking her how often should someone get these massages? And she said when you first start, she recommends every two weeks only for about three to four sessions, depending on what you need. And then after that, if you wanna keep up with maintenance, maybe like once a month or however you decide to like spread it out. She sent me some pictures. Let's see if I can see any difference in the before and after of my belly. Oh, my lower belly. I'm, I'm gonna put the photo in here. Like, obviously, my stomach was just like, uh, yeah. I can definitely see a difference. And I, I made sure to keep it like, stay relaxed in both photos. So it, it would be the same in that tummy girl. <laughs> Especially from the side, you can see a little bit more of my ribs in the front who helped me damn i wish i got her name i didn't even get her name how rude am i but we were just chopping it up and just talking but i need to eat it's time to eat now and then i need Toronto to come home because as much as i would love to sit down and relax i can't i have to take photos for body armor i have to take a photo about to eat lunch or late breakfast. And we have just my little tortilla thing here, which is peppers and onions, egg white, turkey bacon. Okay, look, I know I got a lot of processed meat in here. Just, I don't need, I don't need the judgment. Ham, like turkey breast. I added a little bit of hot sauce. I put some avocado in here and some lactose-free almond cheese from Trader Joe's. So, I'm gonna drink it with the body armor light, the peach mango. Eat this, then we're gonna go take a picture. So, I'll be back in a bit. Okay, back, took that photo for body armor. Now I just put on this little outfit, just cardigan, crop top and leather pants, just a little casual um, photo. So we're gonna go take it outside, take this real quick, and then come in, get comfortable, and probably take a shower because I have oil still on my body, and then start editing.
it is now <laughs> it's about 6 p.m or almost six and not six yet and i am currently crashing i'm coming down hard right now it's been a long day but i'm currently importing photos that we just took i'm gonna go through go through them i, I don't i wasn't loving the ones that we took in this outfit but Teron told me to keep taking some so he took some more but I'm gonna go through the body armor one I'm gonna pick out my top three see if the lighting anything needs to be edited or fixed make sure that the label is nice and clear you can see it and then I'm gonna upload that online so the brand can approve it then I'm gonna take a shower wash my face and just lay here for a minute <laughs> I'm just gonna lay here for a minute I'm gonna try my hardest not to take a nap because it's already 6 p.m. so guess who's 38 hour nap turned into like <laughs> a three hour nap. <laughs> Ron's fault. He came in here, he shut off the light, he turned on the fan, making me all comfortable, and I lost track of time. That's why I leave the nap light on when I nap. Ugh. so tired um it is late and i'm done with my video it's uploaded i entered in all the information sent the link over to my manager so she can send it to the brand to be approved so i'm gonna wait on that and that pretty much wraps up today's it pretty much today we're into tomorrow now um, but that wraps up today's day in the life as a full-time influencer full-time content creator i hope you enjoyed got a little peek in into what it is that we do every day is completely different which is why i absolutely love the job some days i'm swamped and other days i'm chilling <laughs> but yeah that wraps it up tomorrow's well, gonna be another long one because i just have so much content that was filmed and all of that that has to be edited i'm just trying to stay on track of my videos getting them out in advance that way you guys aren't sitting around waiting weeks for me to upload something so i've been very consistent i'm feeling good um i have things already up ready to go and yeah that's that's really coming down what it comes down to is just kind of staying ahead of your content because it's very easy to get behind realistically on tiktok i want to post something daily realistically but if i can get something five days a week i'm okay with that youtube about oh my bad is about to die youtube about two times a week and then instagram maybe four times a week thank you again earth echo for sponsoring the, today's video um i will see you guys in the next one good night yeah, good night. <laughs>